Hi, Regis. Thank you so much for taking time to talk to us. Really appreciate it. You know, my first question is, I know is a lot of fighters, when they're approaching a world title fight, and obviously winning the world title is enough motivation on its own, but is there maybe perhaps any extra motivation knowing that after this fight, if you do win, there's a guaranteed shot at another world title down the line later this year? Well, in this tournament, it's supposed to be, yeah. In, in, I mean, in this tournament, it's supposed to be two belts. Um, so after this fight, um, it's for the WBA belt, and then uh, and then the next fight is supposed to be for the IBF. So yeah, it's supposed to be it's supposed to be back to back. It's supposed to be back to back belts. So that's what I'm looking forward to. I know earlier you said that you wanted the World Boxing Super Series to continue because of the promise of two world titles. But in the last few months, was there maybe perhaps any frustrations from your end wondering if the tournament was going to continue? Or I guess any uncertainty on your end that the tournament was going to continue? Yeah, I mean, at first yeah, it was just kind of it was kind of frustrating because they... You know, at first they told me it was gonna be one thing. It was gonna be a, it's gonna be a quick turnaround with the tournament, and you know, it, it just wasn't happening. So I just kept, you know, I kept bugging my manager Sam. I was like, you know, what's going on? You know, what's what's gonna happen with the fight? I'm, you know, I'm ready to start training camp, and I just had a whole lot of stuff planned. Um, so I was just basically, like, I was just ready to start my training camp. So um, yeah, it was frustrating at first. But um, I kept busy. Most of the time, I stayed in the gym, you know, and and I'm I'm glad that you know it turned out the um, it, the way it turned out. But yeah, it was it was it, yeah it was kind of frustrating at first, just because we didn't know what was going on, and a lot of people would doubt that it was it was even gonna happen. But for me, I just I stayed solid on what I wanted to do. I really want to, I really want to stay in the tournament, and I just kept telling you know I told Sam you know look. My, my my first choice is to stay in the tournament. No matter what, that's my first choice, you know, to stay in the tournament. But we're just looking at the dates and the dates end up lining up right. So, you know, that's you know, we understand the tournament. I'm glad that, I'm glad it happened. Lastly, I know you you faced a lot of solid names in the past year or so, from Julius and Dongo to Terry Flanagan, but heading into this fight for your first world title, your first top world title. Would you consider this the biggest fight of your career thus far? Yes, definitely. I think so. Um, as far as like him being the best fighter of my career, I don't know. I wouldn't know until until I get in the ring with him. But as far as I think it's, I think it is the biggest because it's my first, this is my first chance at a world title. So um, this is definitely for me. This is the biggest fight of my career.